All right, I see the thumbs up. Hey, y'all, took me a nap. Your girl was tired. Oh, my God. Your girl was tired. And your girl went and took her a nap. You know what? Let me fix something else. I don't know if I like this background with this color. It looks so off. Let me see. I like this one better because it got a little of the orange in it. Kind of make it look like it, you know, it go together. Ah. Anyway, I said I was going to wear my glasses tonight. Let me see how I look. She said, put your damn disclaimer up. Oh, God. My disclaimer says what I say out of my mouth is based on my opinion and my opinion only. Oh, y'all. Do I look studious? Um, anyway. Hey, y'all. Hey, 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 hey. What are we talking about today? Well, we're going to talk about a couple of things, okay? I wish I had a cordless one. Who's in the house tonight? I see Queen in the house tonight. I see Tamara in the house tonight. I see Marissa in the house tonight. I see Kim in the house tonight. I see QC in the house tonight. JLo in the house tonight. I see Black Swan in the house tonight. Truly Blessed in the house tonight. I see Tinkers in the house tonight. Latrice in the house tonight. Hey, Robbie in the house tonight. Miss Keita You in the house tonight. And Valerie in the house tonight. I see Betty in the house tonight. Mama Three in the house tonight. Patty Ready in the house tonight. Oh, who's in the house tonight? I see Lakeisha in the house tonight. Is me in the house tonight. Aura Hank is in the house tonight. Hey, Charmaine in the house tonight. I need some music. Renee in the house tonight. Miss Tanya in the house tonight. I see Deanne in the house tonight. Hey, the lover D in the house tonight. And Sam in the house tonight. I see Yaz in the house tonight. And Barbara in the house tonight. Uh oh, Doris in the house tonight. I see Bree in the house tonight. Outlaw. <laughs> The name is that outlaw bell in the house tonight. Hey, Shen, Shen, oh Lord, I'm about to mess your name up. Shonda Lisa in the house tonight. Miss Lady in the house tonight. Toya Whole Temple in the house tonight. Oh no, Toya Whole Temple is gone in the house tonight. <laughs> Misha in the house tonight. Melinda in the house tonight. Pretty C in the house tonight. Kings and Queens in the house tonight. Hey, Kiva in the house tonight. Black Swan in the house tonight. Pokey in the house tonight. Hey, Renee in the house tonight. <laughs> Who I miss? Let me go back up. Let me go back up. Nicole in the house tonight. Jeanette in the house tonight. I see Bless in the house tonight. Elaine in the house tonight. Hey, Townsend in the house tonight. Kimberly in the house tonight. I see Kim in the house tonight. Hey, just a mess in the house tonight. I see Nelly Nell in the house tonight. Sade in the house tonight. Hey, Sandra in the house tonight. Tamika in the house tonight. I see Sharon in the house tonight. And Lynn in the house tonight. And Sherry in the house tonight. And tonight is her birthday. Lady in the house tonight. Uh oh, I see another Sharon in the house tonight. I see Trisha B. Patricia PG Glam in the house tonight. Hey, now Terry in the house tonight. Irma in the house tonight. And Yolanda in the house tonight. I see Terry in the house tonight. Hey, Juanette in the house tonight. Mona in the house tonight. I see Denise in the house tonight. Rashida in the house tonight. And Rita in the house tonight. I see Sonia in the house tonight. Hey, 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 hey listen, they hate me because they can't beat me. <laughs> I see Talissa in the house tonight. Who I miss? Who I miss? Who I miss? Who I miss? Michelle in the house tonight. Miss mm, Tita U in the house tonight. Monique in the house tonight. I see Angie in the house tonight. Lady Unicorn is in the house tonight. Hey, who's in the house tonight? Did I miss anybody tonight? Hey, mm, 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 mm. they hate me because they can't beat me. Who I miss? I see a couple of Kims. So I said, Kim and Kimberly, see y'all out there. See y'all. It's a lot of Kim. It's more fun. Kim C. Kim a lot. <laughs> Wait a minute, baby. Sister in the house tonight. I see you, girl. I see you, girl. Wanda in the house tonight. I see Enza in the house tonight. 
I see that girl love chance in the house tonight. J. Lou in the house tonight. Jazzy Jazz in the house tonight. Hey, Jazzy. Girl, Tondra in the house tonight. I see Nicole in the house tonight. Who else I miss? Lottie Jones in the house tonight. Nicole Lee in the house tonight. Dion is in the house tonight. Doom, 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 doom. Did I miss anybody tonight? I, I see Rima in the house tonight. I see Sean in the house tonight. I see, ooh, I'm about to jack your name up in the house tonight, but I'm going to try to break it down in the house tonight. I see Kahari in the house tonight. Did I get it right? Kahari, is that how you say your name? Kahari in the house tonight. Hey, so Mary in the house tonight. Did I get everybody? I think I got everybody I see. Uh oh, wait a minute, hold on. Burner in the house tonight. Tender T in the house tonight. Aura Hanks in the house tonight. Charmaine in the house tonight. A Deborah in the house tonight. The Lover Day in the house tonight. Sam P in the house tonight. A A A A A A A A A A A A. Do I see anybody new? Do I see anybody new? I'm looking, 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 looking. I think I said Deanna. If I didn't, Deanna in the house tonight. Hey, Miss Key to you in the house tonight. I think I said that already. Janice in the house tonight. Mary Smith in the house tonight. Pretty C in the house tonight. Hey, 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 hey. Lisa in the house tonight. She said, hey, y'all. Hey, girl, elevated. Or in the house tonight. Hey, I see you. Sharonda in the house tonight. Miss Boss Lady in the house tonight. I see you, girl. Marlon in the house tonight. It is me in the house tonight. Hey, Ladder Last in the house tonight. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Rita Harris in the house tonight. She said, Keep it G with me is in the house tonight. Shirley Mack in the house tonight. She said, You better know it, Fruity. Pebbles in the house tonight. <laughs> Who else we got, y'all? One on one for the road is in the house tonight. The Holland girl Tamika is in the house tonight. <laughs> Shirley Mack is in the house tonight. She said, you better know it. <laughs> uh oh, I got a super chat, super chat, Black Swan. Thank you for the super sticker, girl. I appreciate you. Who we got? Her four foot fellas in the house tonight. <laughs> y'all know it. Jay Lou in the house tonight. Y'all so funny. Yolanda Tucker in the house tonight. Nancy in the house tonight. Donna K is in the house tonight. Carol Woods in the house tonight. I see Corey is in the house tonight. Mm, Cassie in the house tonight. Nicole's in the house tonight. Mm -mm -mm. Deborah R is in the house tonight. Tammy B in the house tonight. She said, you can't say this day. Tammy Baby's in the house tonight. What? <laughs> Who else we got? Angie in the house tonight. I see you, Angie. Lisa in the house tonight. I see Janice in the house tonight and Liz in the house tonight. Kate Sean's in the house tonight. What? Health, wealth, and lifestyles in the house tonight. Rashida's in the house tonight. Michelle Ford's in the house tonight. See Baldwin in the house tonight. I see you, girl. Bond in the house tonight. Kimberly T's in the house tonight. I said, more you miss Sharonda. Show runs in the house tonight. <laughs> Who we got? K Juice in the house tonight. I see you, girl. Dez with the T's in the house tonight. Y'all better know. Y'all go follow Dez in the T page, honey. Go follow Dez with the T. Dez with the T. Go follow her page. Who else we got? Miss Lady in the house tonight. Justin in the house tonight. I got Justin in the house. What Justin is this? Oh, Justine in the house tonight. Hey, Crack Women. A uh, Chris N in the house tonight. Kimberly M in the house tonight. RL in the house tonight. Tammy Jones in the house tonight. Baby sister in the house tonight. Who's baby sister? Shirley Max in the house tonight. Angie Poo's in the house tonight. Tanisha Cole's in the house tonight. Shantisa Bailey in the house tonight. Hey, bop, 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 bop. Baby Jeff's in the house tonight. Oh, you new girl. What it be, what it be, what it be, what it be. And see, ball one is in the house tonight. I see you, Sharon. Sharon Lake Lakeland Smith is in the house tonight. 
Yolanda Kendra's in the house tonight. Hey, who else? We got Nadia in the house tonight. Hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. Hey, I see some new faces. Hey, y'all. Wait a minute. Stephanie's in the house tonight. Tyrese in the house tonight. Just being Georgiana is in the house tonight. What? Who else? Who else? Who else? I got Adrian in the house tonight. Ross Jones, Rose Jones in the house tonight. A X Factor in the house tonight. Carmelita in the house tonight. Who else do we have in the house tonight? Michelle Ford. She said, I clutched my pearls a little when you said Justin was in the house tonight. <laughs> she said, my daughter listened and heard my name and cheered. Oh, my God. Hey, what it be, what it be, what it be. We are in the house tonight. She said, drop that. Drop that Coca-Cola link. Uh-oh, let me go grab it, child. I'm going to go get it, child. I'm going to go get it. But listen, it is so good to be in here with you all. Yes, yes, yes. She said 301 views. Let's get those likes up. Oh, Listen, one of my moderators just dropped it. Tinker said, I love y'all. I love you too, girl. We love you too, Tinker Boo, Tinker Bell. That's our little Tinker Tinker. We love us some tink. Listen, y'all, we're going to cover a few things tonight, honey. Shine. Let's cover oh, where we going to start first. Y'all know it'd be so much going on in this world. Hey, Jennifer W. Now, y'all know we wait next month. Actually, this month. Oh, boy. Jesus. I said next month. Like, I forgot October to start, honey. Y'all know Cora and Justin goes back to court this month, honey. We just wait patiently. Y'all know I'm already going to know. I mean, I'm already going to keep y'all informed. But you know what? If I was him, I would be on pins and needles. Why? Well, because, you know, I see you, Lady B. Lady B in the house tonight. Because, hey, Jennifer Williams in the house tonight. Because things are not working out. Like a lot of these internet daddies thought that they would. Okay? There's a lot of internet daddies. Hey, Nahimi. She said, I'm in the house tonight. I see you, girl. Nahimi in the house tonight, and Donna Kay's in the house tonight. I see you, girl. She said, my grandson said, why are you always watching Amora? Oh, tell your grandson, because this is where you want to be, to listen to the tea. I see you, KJ. KJ in the house tonight, okay? She said, Sharon Lee is in the house tonight. You better know it, Sharon. I see you, girl. I see you. I see you. Well, there's a lot of internet dads that want to be call to the front. You know what I mean? A lot of internet dad want to discount their baby mama to rise to the top, you know, for content and for people to try to put down their baby mamas. Now, you know, y'all know I don't hate no man. How can I? Hell, you need, you need a man and a woman to make a child. So how am I going to hate a man? I don't hate a man, even though they think I do. I see you, Kia. Kia in the house tonight. Cassandra in the house tonight. She said, hey, Amor, I'm late. What y'all talking about tonight? Girl, we talking about a little everything. But right now, we own these internet daddies that want to be seen and heard at the same damn time. I see you, D. Adams, in the house tonight. I see you. Can't sleep. Come by with Chris in the house tonight, y'all. Shirley matches. I love watching Amor. Thank you, girl. So these internet daddies, and ain't nothing wrong with showing off your daddy skills. But you don't have to show off your daddy skills by putting down the baby mama. You don't have to do that. Just as the baby mama don't have to show off her mama skills to put down the daddy. You don't need to do that, right? You can show people that you a bomb ass daddy, right? That you do, you know, that you out here doing what you're supposed to do as a daddy without having to put down the mama. But are some of these um, internet daddies, internet daddies, the one that want to show 15 zillion photos, old photos at that of them and their children but those that want to do that and put down the moms those are the ones that we don't like honey we we we, we all for daddies being daddies yeah 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 mm -hmm. we'll even push that we all for daddies being daddies but you don't have to be a daddy and try to step on the heads of the mother same with the mom the mom don't have to be a good ass bomb ass mom and step on the heads of daddy but here lately we've been having coming to the front We've been having some internet daddies. They want recognition as being a dad at the same time. They want to bash and put down the mother of the child for what? 
Hmm? We got three of them, right? Three of them. And two, oh, well, you know what? Damn, I was about to say two. All three of them are in court. Hello? All three of them are in court right now. All three baby daddies, all three internet dads are in court. We got Justin, we got Robert, we got the Hurt, Jerron Hurt. All three baby daddies are in court. Make that make sense. All three of them in court. Now, who initiated it? We have Jerron, he initiated it. Well, he didn't initiate it from the beginning, again, and she initiated it from the beginning. And then he didn't leave well enough alone. So he doubled back and tried to get full custody. We talked about that yesterday, right? Oh, wait. Oh, oh, let me not forget. Thank you to me. She said, hold on. I forgot. Name some more. Ma Martel Hope. Okay. That's four. That's four baby daddies. And he's in court too. Damn. Hey, uh, uh, Tyrese, that's five. That's five. You got Tyrese. You got Martel Hope. You got Love Truth. You got Justin. And you got the, the her twins that Jerron. That's five baby daddies that I know of. Anybody know anymore? Now, here soon, I don't know. We're going to have to just wait and see. But it might be, uh, what's his name? Um, Miller, Brett Miller. Do we smell Brett Miller? Because Brett Miller may be next. He might be the sixth one. But right now, we got five guys. Tyrese. Y'all know Tyrese, crying Tyrese, right? Baby boy. <laughs> we got Tyrese. We got Montel Holt. Ma Martel Holt, I'm sorry. Martel plays on, uh, is it Love and, um, uh, Love and something, uh, what's his name? Huntsville? What Martel Holt play on? Love and, Love and Hip Hop Huntsville? Let me see. Let me just tell you, Martel Holt plays on uh what's the name of this show Ma Mary Love and Marriage Huntsville Love and Marriage Huntsville is Martel Hope hmm? I need to do a collage if somebody can do that real fast and put these guys on there put Martel Hope Martel M-A-R-T-E-L-L -L, Hope H O L T Tyrese, <laughs> uh, Latrue, Justin, and Jerron. Put all five of them on there. Wait a minute. Somebody say Ray J. Damn. But is Ray J, is he all the way out the picture? Ray J and, uh, but do Ray J be trying to be an internet dad? I don't know. I've never seen, I've never heard Ray J put the baby mama down. Have y'all? If you heard Ray J put the baby daddy, I mean, baby mama down, tell me. Corey, yes, Corey, Lord Jesus. How we forget Corey? How we forget Corey? Okay, so Ray J did put down the ex-wife? I didn't know that he put the ex-wife down. Matter of fact, I thought he just said he loved him. Thank you, Tammy, baby. For the Coca-Cola, baby. I appreciate that. Okay, so Corey. She's an offset. Put Cardi down. She's an old more Ray J just like them. It's. He pushed her in the pool. Yeah, but didn't they make up since then? But anywho, look at look at these look at these internet dads. He says she was a she has a gambling problem. That's a little different though. S calling one thing out than dragging her every day. Now the ones that we named, right? The ones that we named, they drag their baby mamas. They drag them. They talk about their current relationships, you know, because that's what the uh uh the hurt father does he's so oh, he's so hurt honey his name fit him perfectly right because she left him he's gonna try to tell the judge she left me and 
And the next day she moved in with another man. What does that have to do with you keeping the kids from her? Hmm? But so far, we've seen somebody lose parental rights of their child, right? We've seen somebody threaten to take parental rights. And we've seen Martell. I don't know what Martell doing. Martell is stalking the hell out of his baby mama. Um, what's Martell X name? Uh, I know it, but I just can't think of it. I top of my head. I said I was going to start watching that craziness, but I haven't yet. Uh, Cherie. He, he stalked her, honey, because he apparently knows... What's going on? Matter of fact, somebody sent me that paperwork. I need to read that paperwork because y'all know he just took her back to court. He basically told the judge, oh, is it Melanie or is it Cherie? Oh, it's Melanie. It's Melanie Holt. It's Melanie. This Melanie. This is how you spell it. Melanie Holt. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. My bad, my bad. So he basically told the judge, that's the one that got four kids with him, right? Melanie. Melanie has the four children with him. He going to give her purdy hell. He going to give her pure, purdy narcissistic hell. He literally just told the judge. Now, I don't know if you could do this or not, but he I guess he put in the divorce papers that she can't have a man to spend a night over her house. They can't co cohabitate, right? So he got in the paperwork where he is taking her for contempt right now. He got in there that Oh, she let this person spend a night over her house. Like, would you tell me this? Would you really hold your kid's father or mother, right? In contempt if she have another man sleeping over to her home? Would you care? Pritchy, Corey Pritchy. But would you care if your baby mama or your baby daddy had another person sleeping over to his home if you guys were no longer together. Would y'all care? All right, I see somebody say yes, somebody says no. Explain the yes, why would you care? Why would you care if he had somebody else over to the house? Miss B, tell me why. Tell me why would you care if another person spends the night And said her brother gay and don't want him watching the kids. Is her brother gay and he don't want the, the gay brother watching the kids? Does that even make sense? What does he think? Uh, what does he think he's gonna do? He think he's gonna jump off on the kids? She said no, as long as he trusts that person exactly. She said, well, Robert don't want a third party controlling. Robert don't want a third party controlling is what it is. Yeah. And that's another thing. Would you be like, I don't want no third party. I don't want nobody else dropping off my child but the mama or the daddy. I don't want no third party. I want to meet with her or him. And that's it. That's all. I don't want to meet with nobody else. It is control. That is, listen, Mont Martel, right? Robert, Justin, they all want control. Do you know Justin said the same thing? Not only does he not want a third party, right? Not only does Justin not want a third party, Justin don't even want nobody with her while she was picking up the baby. He want her to be by herself. And I don't know how they're getting this put in the divorce decree. How are they letting this ride? How are judges signing this into the divorce decree? Okay, you got to be by yourself when you drop your child off. The man doesn't want no one to be with you. Therefore, you need to be by yourself. Nobody else can drop the baby off. The daddy can't drop the baby off. The sister can't drop the baby off. I want you only to drop the baby off. And, oh, by the way, you can't bring your sister. You can't bring the sister husband. Oh, because he's intimidated and afraid of his life. Right? Exactly, Terry. Terry says she would prefer a third party. The hiring the four foot felon says, I, she said, if I hate the mama so bad, I would beg for a third party. Ooh, she said, I would beg for a third party. Tinker said, I would never go for that. She said, that's dangerous for some women. I wonder why the court do not think it's dangerous. 
that, that they actually write it into the, de the decree. All right. You can't have a third party. You cannot bring nobody with you. Oh, but meet out in the front of the courthouse, not the courthouse, but meet out in the front of the police station and you'll be safe. And we all know that's not true, right? If they agree, then yeah, the judge legit legitimizes it or legalizes it. Yeah, I hear what you're saying. You're saying if they agree, meaning that, well, if they both agree, like in mediation or something, then a judge will sign off on it. I see what you're saying, but I would think, I don't know. I wouldn't agree with that. I just wouldn't agree. You're not going to control that part. She said more men are becoming drama queens, and they are. They are. They so much are. These men are worse than a lot of these women out here. The roles are slowly changing, and I wonder why. Why? But which one out of the five that we named? Well, the six, because we got to add Corey in there. I don't know if Ray J fits it just yet. Y'all let me know if y'all really think we should name Ray J. But La True, Hurts Twin, Martel, uh, Tyrese. And who was the fifth one? I need to write it down again. Tyrese, Martel, Corey, Hirsch Twin, Justin, and The Truth. So that's six. Which one is the worst? Somebody said Corey. Somebody said Justin. Who do y'all think the worst out of those six? She said, don't add Ray J just yet. Okay, we're going to keep Ray J out. Ray J is left out. We got Justin. Number one, La Truth, Martel, Corey, Tyrese. I gotta write them down, y'all. I done forgot just that fast. Somebody write all six names down in the comments because I keep forgetting. <laughs> Somebody said it's hard between Justin and Robert, okay? De Dion said all of them, damn it. She said Justin and the truth is tied for number one. Somebody said Corey. All right. Somebody said Justin and Robert. Uh-oh, Kimberly said Martel. Martel is the whole worst. I may have to agree with you. Y'all know Martel released a whole video on Tasha K and said that he was abused. Y'all do know that, right? I think we missed him one. You missed him somebody. No, you got to take Ray J off and put Corey. And on this list right here, you got Tyrese, Justin, Robert. Take Ray J off and put Corey Martell. And then don't forget about the Hurt Twins dad. His name is... Uh, Jeron, J-E-R-O-N, I think it is. Jeron, Jeron Hurt. J-E-R-O-N Hurt. Let's see his name. I think it's Jeron. It's J-E-R, two R's, J-E-R-R-O-N, J-E, so like almost Jerome, but Jeron, Jeron Hurt, J-E-R-R-O-N. So put take Ray J off, add Jerron, add um, Corey, and add Martel. She said, "You know what? These women are different from me. From me, cause okay, take your child. Go on, be a single dad." <laughs> I feel you, but you know what? You got to think about it. Would you really let these daddies that I'm talking about these type of daddies be? Would you would you give the babies to these jokers? She said, hell, the young lady in Georgia just got unalived by her ex-husband. A court hearing in front of the courthouse a few weeks ago. She allegedly asked for a police escort and was denied. She said, hashtag sad. 
So I found out that I did do that story, but she didn't ask for a police escort. Her friend did, and it was, I want to say the day prior or something. It was a different, a different day. She said they all coochie butt hurt. They all coochie hurt. They all ain't shit, but Roberta done blasted his own damn kids and led a mob of bitches, batches, bachestos, <laughs> bachestos, drag his baby mama. That makes him the worst. No, you got to think about it. The other ones did too. Justin, he let people drag Cora for filth. I'm talking about for filth. Now, see, we was just, we were really all up in the truth saga. But listen, the her twin dad, he got the aunties that dragged. Matter of fact, they dragged that baby mama so bad. They dragged April so bad that April closed down her social media. They ran her off of social media. Okay. So those aunties, they came after that baby mama. Justin supporters came after Cora. They, they still on her. They still on Cora. Child, they don't let Cora eat an apple without them saying something. If Cora crunch on an apple, they're going to talk about it. Look how loud she crunching. Look how, look how her mouth go to the left and she chew. Look how she walk. Look how she breathe. Look how she look. Look how she, you know, turn her head. Hold on. <laughs> Thank you, girl. Somebody gave me a... <laughs> Put these damn daddies up here, y'all. Hold on one second, child. Let me put these daddies up here. Let me see that you leave anybody out. Girl, put these daddies up here, girl. Hold on. It's a hood baby daddy. It's not a hood baby daddies right here, child. Look. All right. Let me know that we missed any. Thank you for the super chat, Michelle. She said the thing about Martel is why he was a horrible husband and still bitter. I don't think he's an overall bad person like RH is. Martel is a good father off the internet. He he just a he just a hoe. But you know what? I, I hear you, Michelle. But how can we say he's a good father if he's dragging the mother in front of the kids, right? And have the kids, right, checking her phone and stuff. Because how does he know that she's still texting some other guy? Unless, right, hold on, she made it look better. Give me, let me do this one. He even got the kids checking her phone. Unless he got a wire tag, everything y'all telling me about the other day, on her phone. And does that make him a good father? If he's, if he has the kids spying on mama hmm all right i got a different picture hold on this one looks better because the, the other head is cut off let me take this one down you gotta hold him responsible for the things that he's doing to the mama as well right we gotta do that right i don't know which one first and which one second let me try this one okay she said, this one is better. All right, hold on. All right, all right. So here we go. Okay, she said Martell is a terrible person, all right? So um, she said, play ain't no sunshine when the ash is gone. <laughs> Listen. She said, you need to watermark your stuff for more. I be saying I'm going to do that, child. I'm going I'm to do one. But we got Martin. I'm going to put the names on it. We got Jerron. Jerron Hurts. We got Tyrese. What's Tyrese's last name? Gibbons or Gibson or something. Tyrese something. We got Corey Pritchett. We got Martel Hope. We got Justin Dean. And we got Love Truth. Okay? Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, of these six up here, Gibson. Okay, Gibson. Tyrese Gibson. Of these six, 
Y'all vote. Which one do y'all think is worse? Matter of fact, I'm going to do a poll right quick. Hold on. We're going to do a poll. I want to see what y'all come up with. Give me a second. We're going to do a poll. I want to see where y'all at. Like. Hold on. Don't do it yet. Don't do it yet. We're going to do it in. We're going to do a right poll. Give me a second. All right. Which internet dad? Hold on. Damn it. I smell onions. My daughter must be cooking again. Pitch making spaghetti. Which internet daddy? Are right, you gotta you gotta read the question? All right, number one, we have Jerron Hurt. Number two, we have Tyrese Gibson. Number three, we have Corey Pritchett. I may have spelled Pritchett wrong, but whatever. We have Martel Holt. Why won't let me put more than them? Why well, can't put? It won't let me put. It won't let me put but four? I can't even put Justin and Robert. Hold on. Damn. Give me a second. Hmm. Why can't I put? Two more. Hold on. Ha, ha, ha. All right, I know what I'm going to do. Damn, damn, damn. Why well, won't let me put only but four? That's no fun. Uh, it, should, it should let me put two more. All right, hold on. All right, it won't let me put, um, it won't let me put two more. It will only let me put four. So I need to combine two. <laughs> she said they should have it have been the first two on the list. Who? Oh. Justin and... I'm going to do Justin and Robert. Justin and Robert is one to me. Uh, mm, okay, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do... Look, this is what I'm going to do. You got your famous ones. These are the famous ones. Okay, and then, all right, now, I don't know if that's going to work, but we're going to try it, all right? Y'all just going to have to look. Must contain one. Oh, shoot. I see what it's doing. Okay, on one, one list, I'm going to have, oh, I know this ain't going to be, this ain't even going to be fair. This ain't even gonna be fair. I already know it. Hold on. On one of them, it got three people. <laughs> these are the these are the famous ones: Tyrese, Corey, and Martel. All right, there we go. I can't. Hey, it won't. It only let me put four people. Four four different things. So on one of the lines, number two, I got uh, Tyrese, uh, Corey, and Martel. Because them the rich ones. Those are the ones with the real money. The ones that don't have the money is uh, Justin, Robert, and Jerome. Those are the beggars. All three of them beg on the internet, right? 
But Corey, Martel, and Tyrese actually do have money. <laughs> they actually have money. It's three out of the six, three of them actually have money. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, she watermarked it for me this time. Let me put it back up, watermark. <laughs> Those three of them actually have money and three are broke. Three are beggars. <laughs> three of them. Jerron, now I'm going to say, Jerron begs more than Robert. Y'all may not like that, but Jerron begs more than Robert. <laughs> Jerron is the beggar. Jerron, Robert, and then um, Jerron, Robert, and then Justin, because Justin don't really, really big. She said Robert won. Hold on. Let me look at the poll. <laughs> Hold on. I got the hiccups now, y'all. God dang it. She said Jerron is the number one beggar. Jerron is the number one beggar. <laughs> Jerron is the number one beggar. Hold on. Let's see who's winning. God damn. All right. I'm not in it yet. All right. So, damn. Now, are y'all saying it's because it's the sector? Y'all are giving Jerron. Y'all let him off the hook. Y'all are definitely giving Jerron a pass. He's the lowest right now. Listen, the question was, which internet daddy is the worst when it comes to performing for the internet? Robert is leading the pack. 82%. <laughs> Maybe because he's the actor, remember? <laughs> Y'all have him. Okay, now 81%. Okay, now performing for the internet, performing to be a good daddy, coming out here telling people they're a great dad. Come on, y'all have Robert at 81%. <laughs> she said it's the truth. <laughs> so y'all think he is better at performing. I said, I said, which internet daddy is the worst when it comes to performing for the internet? Meaning that. Y'all got it right. Performing for the internet, meaning that they do it the most. They perform for the internet the most. I'm trying to get this damn thing out of my way. Hold on. All right. I think that's better. Y'all see my face? I don't see my face. Oh, shit. Hold on. Let me fix this thing. Oh, I think it's the camera. Oh, yes, yeah, the camera. Hold on. <laughs> Why y'all tell me y'all couldn't see me at all, child? Let me put this over here so y'all can see my face at least. There we go. Can y'all see it now? <laughs> here we go. Is that better? Is that better? All right, I think that's better. Now, which one is, okay, she said, I can see you. Oh, y'all can see me the other way? Oh, I couldn't see myself. I need to take this earring off. It's hurting my ear. Ooh. All right, let me look at the score again. Okay, so Robert is going down. We got uh, RH at 79%. All right, we got Justin coming in second. We got Jerron coming in third, and we got Tyrese, Corey, and Martell coming in last. So y'all think uh, that Tyrese, Corey, and Martell, they don't perform as much for the internet as Robert and Justin and Jerron. It'd be the broke ones. All right, that feels better. She said, I'm not changing mine. Which one you got, Jen Tisa? Who did you vote for? She said, I'm not changing mine. 
She said, I may take mine back. I think Justin does that the most, especially when the kids were able to be seen on the internet. Mm. You got a point. You got a point. You got a point. You got a point because Justin did a lot too, y'all. Don't act like Justin didn't come out here after plum ass food. Justin came out here and called his wife all types of hoes. Y'all remember that? Oh, but Robert did too. Robert did too. Bees and hoes and all that. Oof, Jesus. And and listen, Justin, Robert, and uh, Martel both said that they were DD victims, remember? They said they got their ass beat. <laughs> she said, Justin is a millionaire. <laughs> Justin is not a millionaire. He might have a million followers. <laughs> Justin is definitely not no damn millionaire. <laughs> Justin is definitely not a millionaire. Y'all need to stop playing. Stop playing. Stop playing. Stop playing. Y'all know y'all are playing. Okay. She said, look what I sent you. And you have a moment. All right. Robert is steady going down. I don't know what y'all doing, but he is going down and Justin is coming up. Justin is coming up and Robert is going down. Okay. Girl, you funny. You already know what that means. So Justin numbers, Justin is at 14% right now and Robert still is at 77%. So Robert still leads the pack by a lot. She said, girl, go ahead and give Robert the certified stamp. <laughs> so you trying to say Robert won, hands down. Okay, from where it is right now, it doesn't look like nobody. It's been 199 votes. That means 165 people have not voted. Really, 166. Oh, wait a minute, 204 votes. Okay, come on, you guys. It's 365 people in here. We should have at least 300, at least 300 votes. Because I know it ain't no 165 people in the bushes. Come on, y'all. I need 100 more votes, you guys. Come on. She said, Ari got his whole family running defense for him. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> you are so right. <laughs> he got them all entangled shit. <laughs> All of them tangled up in his web. He's like, shit, if y'all ain't fighting for me, y'all ain't my siblings, hell. <laughs> he got all them siblings fighting for him. You are so right about that, child. Hey, his siblings and a bunch of people on the YouTube streets. He got he even got men's. <laughs> I don't think Corey got any, I don't think Justin got any men's fighting for him. Hey, Robert got men's. <laughs> My friend, oh shit. He got men. So I'm, like, I'm telling you, Robert Hampton is innocent. Y'all better leave Robert alone. I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you right now. Right now. She said, Mr. Moore, maybe your bush is too high to trim them. <laughs> Come on. Come out the bushes, y'all. Y'all know I ain't listen. I ain't gonna bite y'all heads off. Vote. <laughs> y'all can vote too, child. Y'all can vote. I bet if I put a vote up there and say who the who look better, me or Dawn? I bet you they'll come out the bushes then, honey. They'll say, Dawn look better, child. Dawn of the dead. <laughs> Her name is Puffy. Puffy. She said, Robert is textbook dry beggar, so he won the award. <laughs> you think he a textbook dry beggar? You must have not heard Laurent Jerron big, child. That's Joe right there. Now, I do think Jerron begs worse than Robert because Robert don't pretend to cry when he's begging. Now, Jerron does. Come on now. I know you have seen that man act like he was damn crying, begging. That man, like, and, um, um, I need your help. I need you guys to share because this is just not fair. And, um, and I need you to share it right now. I mean, and you can donate to the GoFundMe. I mean, yeah, this was my love me, livelihood. <laughs> he begs. Come on, y'all. Jerron, he gets it, y'all. She said, more, I'm going to wet them bushes up. <laughs> I'm going to wet them bushes up. 
Girl, to me, go get the bushes. Go wet them up, y'all. She said, R.H. been giving out a dollar all day, knowing he is going to be begging tomorrow. <laughs> going up to random people. They don't even know they on social media. J.D. told the world she had an STD and created... Wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. JD told the world she had an STD and cheated when she was pregnant, called her all types of names, said she was having threesomes, and on and on and on. Now, I knew about all, all the other stuff, but did he say she had an STD? Wait a minute. Did he say she had an STD? Did I miss that part? Did Justin say she had an STD? Lord Jesus. She said, Jenny coming on. Oh, Lord. Well, let me tune in, honey. Let me tune in and let me go on it. Well, it's on 2K, right? Hold on. Y'all, 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 y'all. I'm going to come back to the thing. Hold on. I don't see Jenny on. I don't even see 2K on, to be honest. 2K is not on, y'all. He's not even on. Unless she's coming on her panel. Is Jenny on her panel? I don't see Jenny on unless they went to somebody else's panel because it's not on 2Ks. Let me hit refresh. Oh, gosh, I have to do that, but no, 2K is not on, so Jenny must be on her own. Hey, somebody keep a watch out for me. She said, no, look on her page. She said yours, huh? Let me, uh, hold on. She coming over here? Hold on, we're going to get back to our poll in a minute. Let me look at Jenny Page. Mm. Okay. Okay, so she coming over at nine. Is that eight my time? All right, well, Jenny, when you get here, let me know, girl. Let me know, girl. I would definitely drop the link for Miss Jenny. What happened to her in 2K conversation? She said the debate is on. Oh, which debate? Okay, okay, okay. Let me see that she texts me. Wait a minute, what? Wait a minute. I gotta see this. Damn. <laughs> All right. I just received something, but not from Jenny. I received something that says, um, I'm going to go back to the other one. I received something that said, Toya asked for um, <laughs> Tamika to be incarcerated if found in contempt. It made that make sense. <clears throat> made that make sense. She wants. She wants Tamika incarcerated. All right, so we our poll says Robert RH1 as the worst when it comes to performing for the internet. He won 76%. Justin came in next, which I'm shocked that y'all only gave him 13% because y'all gave all the votes to Robert. And then, but this is only 276 people voting. We got 400 people in here. So you guys didn't barely vote. Y'all did not barely vote. There's a lot of people that did not vote. But so far, Robert is leading the pack. <laughs> as the worst when it comes to performing for social media as a great dad. Coming out here and pretending that he's a great dad. Robert, you won. 
Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Did I get it wrong? She says no. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't read it. I didn't read it. I didn't read it. Oh, my bad. I didn't even read this. I didn't. I'm so sorry. Yep, that's my fault. That's my fault. I thought it was something else. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. I did not read it at all. I did not. I did not. I did not. That is my bad. I don't know if I'm going to release it. I think we don't need to read everything because let me just say this to y'all. I saw a post I sent me where it says Toya just announced that she is asking all of her uh asking people to not speak on her her legal information. Toya has been going to court and telling the judge that I'm a blogger for Tamika, honey. I blog for Tamika and I'm putting all Tamika business down. Well, uh, Toya, you're a liar, one. And um, and Tamika don't even talk. Me and you didn't got, we had our own set of problems. So now they got my name all up in the courts, the judge's mouth. So judge might be listening to my content too. So everybody say, hey, Judge Murphy. Hey, Your Honor. Hey, Your Honor. Yep, me and Toya stay into a job. She dragged me on her page and I dragged her ass right back, Your Honor. I try to drag her up and down, drag her wig straight off her head, okay? So no, I'm not a blogger for Tamika at all, at all. So she mentioned my name in court because she comes for me and I come right back for that ass, okay? Your Honor, all right? So anywho, honey, he might be watching us too, child, because... Toyed and went in there and, and threw my name in the in the little mixture, child. It went in there and threw my name and said I blog for Tamika. So every time I go, um, every time I go live and drag her, I'm doing it on behalf of Tamika. Girl, you know you a liar. Your pants on fire. Why would I drag you for Tamika? No, I get the pleasure out of dragging you for me. I do that for me. I don't drag you for Tamika. I ain't never drug nobody for Tamika. I drag whoever I drag, I drag for me. For me. But she went in the coat and told the judge that I drag her. Every time I come for her, it's because of Tamika. You see how that works? Do you see how it works? See, she wants, so she wants, really, she wants the judge to make me be quiet, right? Because she got the judge thinking that when I come for her, that Tamika. Or she wants Tamika to be held responsible. That's not how shit works. And people smarter than you, girl, the judge know that ain't true. Tamika ain't got no control over me. Me and Tamika don't even talk like that. Every every blue moon, I may say something to Tamika, and Tamika may say something to me. Since her, since her, her mother passed away. I think we may talk maybe once or twice, or maybe three times at the most, right? But for what last I heard, Tamika was like in some type of hiding and she deleted her Facebook page and was gone or whatever. Like when her mama passed away or something like that. I don't even know if she ever came back out. Has she? Has Tamika came back out anybody? Let me know. If she have, I don't know who she came out as. So anyway, she wants to try to tie what I say about her or her family into... I'm speaking on behalf of Tamika. Girl, you know you're wrong for that one. Now, I'll go to court and I'll tell the judge in your face and his face, no, baby, I drag you for you, for me, okay? This between me and you, me and you been going back and forth with each other for a long time. And see, let me tell you what she tried to do. She came and tried to delete her posts, right? <laughs> she tried to delete her posts about Nasty Nate. Why? Because now the judge knows who Nasty Nate is. <laughs> the judge knows who Nasty Nate is. Okay? So I hope the judge is smart enough to know that when they mention Nasty Nate and they come for me, Nasty Nate is going to come back for them. Okay? Period. But yeah, she's trying to, you know, trying to act like um, Every time I drag her ass, every time I talk about her edges, her roaches and everything or whatever that is coming from Tamika, that's not the case, baby. 
at all. Mm -mm. I don't know what type of vendetta hunt Tamika have with each other, but all I know is they both trying real hard to put each other in jail, which is, I think is crazy to me because this internet beef should just been left at internet beef. But y'all doing the absolute most at this point. You know what I'm saying? One of the best friends, one they walking down the sidewalk together laughing and, and <laughs> they were walking together and bouncing up and down and stuff like that. Like they were friend friends. Now all of a sudden they can't fight this stuff. You know what I mean? Hold on. Let me see what this is. Yeah, so now she's talking about some all content creators. I ask that you guys don't speak of me. And let me tell you something. She does stuff like this, right? She puts stuff out like this, telling the content creator, don't speak on her behalf, right? Can y'all see it? Anyway, she does that. And then behind closed doors, she'd be like, drag the ass. Drag her mother effing ass. Drag her. That's what Toya does. Toya puts stuff out this to the public to let the public know. I don't, I'm, I'm publicly saying, you know, don't speak for me about my legal issues out loud, right? She said 2K made a post. He canceled tonight. Oh, okay. So um, she'll, she'll put that out and tell people, right? She said the roaches are innocent. <laughs> the roach is innocent. She'll put it out to tell people, uh, don't, don't talk about my legal issues. I don't want y'all talking about it at all. And then behind closed doors, she'll tell Don, Don, mention it. Say something, Don. Go on out there and say something. He'll go, Don, okay. Y'all, y'all don't listen to them people over there. Them people just be lying and stuff because you know they jealous of all of us. We the clout. We make the internet go round and round and they just mad at us because they wish they was us. They want to be me. They want to look like me, dress like my sister, and they want all the money that my brother have. And then the other one, well, you know, they just know he a whole fruitcake. So they just want to talk about him because they jealous he got two wives. I mean, a wife and a baby mama. Okay. They jealous of us. We got it going on. We are the internet. We created the internet and we're going to keep the internet under our names. Okay. Them old jealous hoes. They mad at us. They wish they could be us. Yeah, we internet famous around this bitch. <laughs> we it. We the clout. Without us, they ain't got shit, okay? They have to talk about us to keep on making money. Because if they don't talk about us, they can't make no money, okay? But we got to keep it going because if we don't keep it going, then we going to die. All of us going to die. Our name ain't going to be relevant no more in social media. So we really need this Brianna story to last for another 22 and a half years. Because if it don't, then we ain't going to be nothing. We got to eat off something. We need the supporters to give us cash. That's for our drinkity drink drink and our smokity smoke smoke money. Okay? And you know Robert need to pay his bills over there. Okay? Because Valencia, she running out taking care of him. She can't afford all this. And you know Valencia ain't going to come out here and ask nobody for no cash out. She too prideful. She too prideful. Okay? She ain't going to do that, all right? What is this I'm looking at? Hold on. Who is this? Well, I still haven't gotten it real. Wait a minute, what is this? Y'all, what the hell is this? See, you know, when the tea get dropped in my inbox, then they get mad, right? Then they get mad when I put it out, right? Hold on. <laughs> Who's in the blue? All right, but who's in the blue? Who's in the blue? Okay.
All right. Let me read it first before I uh, send it out. I mean, before I post it. Do you have the other the other half of it? I need the whole thing. Hold on, do you have the other part? All right. Um, so apparently, the Sharia leaked. Did it come from the Sharia? So Desharia put on her TikTok. I'm not sure why. Yes, okay. Desharia put a message between her and her daddy on her TikTok. So let's just read it. Hmm. All right. So I don't know what day this conversation took place because it don't have the date, right? But I don't know if this was, does TikTok have like an inbox? I don't know. Oh, no, it has to be, uh, it has to be the phone, right? But anyway, let's go. I right, blow this bad boy up then. Shit, if, if, if uh, the shard is going to put it out there, then that means she want people to read it, right? All right, well, we about to read it, shit. If she put it out there, that means she want it to be read for whatever the reason, all right? <laughs> All right, so I asked, and they said the blue is the Sharia, and the other one is the dad. Okay, it says, call me. The Sharia says, well, I still haven't gotten a real apology for the stuff you said to me and of me. Yes, I apologize for anything that I have said rude or hurtful to you. You stated in the comments saying what Don did wasn't wrong as in exploiting my body to public, my under half, even if anything wasn't technically showing, it's showing, it's still cleavage skin. She put personal messages out for what? Attention or money. I don't know what the reason was for, but that made me trust less people now, especially family. You made me feel like my own father can't even have my back because even while people was bashing you, I still deleted comments or blocked them, people, or at least stuck up for you on my page. I just like the way you blamed my mom and everyone that was around me for the way I think and the way I speak. I never could do that because I always shut down. When I do tell you how I feel, it's a lecture or you just don't understand me at all. I don't ask for you to do too much. Just actually listen to me instead of making everything about you for a change or stop posting things about me. That's not true of me. That's not me at all. Only the man above and I know who I am. And he says, Desharia, what have I said about you? Oh my God. You can't be listening to what other people are saying. I said. Okay. And it looks like she says, never, you never, 
I mean, what? It says, I don't know what that says. I don't even want to make it out. So then she must have copied and pasted the message in which he said something negative about her. But I'm not sure why she would only just post this. Hold on. Okay. All right. I'm being told that um, this right here, never make him whatever, never make him understand, I guess, is a song that was playing when she posted this on her TikTok. So I don't know really how TikTok works. Do TikTok have like a story or something? So I'm not sure. It says never make him listen. Oh, never make him listen. Oh, so it's a song. She said a more watermark it. Hell, I don't know. <laughs> y'all supposed to send it to me, watermark. Remember I told y'all that. I don't be knowing how to do all that. So if y'all send it to me, watermark, I, I show it watermark. I don't know how to, I don't know how to, it don't have no watermark button on here. I know um, what y'all going to be the first one to grab it. Uh, what's her name? Lupop. <laughs> Lupop going to get it. Oh, it looks like her Instagram story. Oh, it's in her Instagram story. He literally dismissed her feelings. Mm. So anyway, he's basically saying, Desharia, what have I said about you? You can't be listening to what other people are saying I said. And that's the thing. You understand what I'm saying? He will literally come out and talk about her. He's talked about, you know, all kinds of stuff about her, right? But yet then he'll try to make you believe that you didn't say anything. I mean, excuse me, that he didn't say anything. He would literally come out and pretend that, you know, she said it's still on her page. Is it on her Facebook page or her? Um, let me let me go to her Facebook page right quick. Or is it her? Uh, let me look under the Sharia. Because I want to say. Don't Facebook and Instagram go together some type of capacity to where if she posted on Instagram, it'll come over to Facebook in the story, right? Where it's not in her story on Facebook. Uh, somebody said it's on TikTok. I don't know how to get to TikTok. Let me see. Tick. TikTok. Desharia, what? Desharia D I D I me. All right, let's go. Desharia D I me. All right, I guess. Let's look. Is this it? And then it's in the story. I don't see no story. Uh, I don't know how that worked. I don't see it. <laughs> I'm on her TikTok. She must have took it down. I just saw it on there. All right. Well, let me pull a TikTok up because I don't see it. She says it's there. I just saw it. Well, let me... Y'all know I don't be knowing how to operate this thing. Y'all can maneuver. All right. She said, Jenny said she's coming in five minutes. Okay. Now, where would I look for that? This is the TikTok. She said, click on the circle. I did, didn't I? I clicked on the circle. It's not doing anything. Maybe because this is a desktop, maybe. I did click on the circle. I did click on the picture, y'all. Click on the picture I am. Um, she said, are you signed in? Probably not. I don't even know how to sign in. I don't even know if I'm... Uh, I don't even know my, uh, hold on. 
Let me do some right quick. Desharia. Oh. Oh, okay, wait a minute. She did say some more. It says, I can send more if you like. All right, hold on, y'all. Oh, wow. Well, I can't see it here, but it says, okay, the name of the song she was singing was I Can Never Make Him Love Me. And then she says, wow, that's crazy. She said, I can never make him love me. And then it says, I can send you more if you like. And he never responds. Hold on. Okay, so she must have sent him. She said the song is called Bad Religion. Oh, okay. Bad Religion. Anyway, so she's definitely, she's doing what, um, um, Bootsy daughter did. She's hollering out for her dad. Okay. Um, she's screaming out for her daddy. And he basically, I don't know. I ain't gonna say. He basically, I don't think that, you know, everything that she said, and then he says, oh, you gotta stop listening. When have I ever said anything about you? You gotta stop listening to them people. Uh, what did he say? He said, uh, Deshari, what have I said about you? You can't be listening to what other people are saying. I said, okay, because that's his way of saying the same way he did with Brianna. I didn't say that. I ain't saying nothing about you. I wasn't talking about you. That wasn't me. That was the internet. Okay. Now um, she said, "Try your phone." I did try my phone. That's what I'm. That's what I did. I looked it up on here, and that's what it, that's what it says right now. I'm not gonna. Put the rest of it up there because I could just tell you right here what it says. Okay. So basically, uh, she's crying out for her daddy. And, you know, I, I'm assuming that he, you know, he's probably like a lot of men. <laughs> Let's think about it for a minute. What do men like to do when y'all in arguments? They like to sweep shit up on the rug and act like ne nothing never happened. Like, we good. Why you still mad? We I ain't mad at you about now. We good or we I ain't saying that about you. Just forget everything I said. Because he doesn't want to apologize. You know what I mean? He probably feels that he doesn't owe her any apology. I don't know why she posted it, though. I'm not sure. What, why do y'all think she posted posted that because she want people to see it just like um Bootsy daughter came to the internet because she wanted people to see it so they're definitely she's definitely crying out to her father some of you guys are late i've already uh then clicked on the profile and read the rest rest of the stuff that's on there honey some of y'all might be a little bit behind y'all need to go out and come back in rita said he got too much pride to apologize mm. Because he hurt and crying out for love. Because she's hurt and crying out for love. Yep. I think Boosie and his daughter will get it right because he loves his kids. Oh, they already got it right. Boosie came out the very next day, baby. Boosie was not playing. You hear me? Boosie came out the next day and was like, oh, y'all ain't about to make me pretend. Y'all ain't going to try to make it seem like I don't love my kids. Y'all better stop playing in a net. He didn't, Boosie didn't feed into the internet noise, okay? He made it right with his baby, all right? She said she posted it an hour ago. 
I know where to put it up there, though, baby. She said he posted it an hour ago on TikTok. So she posted it one hour ago. But now, why do y'all think that she posted it? Why do you think that Desharia posted their conversation to the internet? Is she trying to tell us, I sent that to my dad and he didn't respond? Or is she telling us, I'm having an open dialogue with him and he's pretending that I'm grown and too busy. She said, Miss Amore, I think she listened to you because that post she shared is the one you talked about the other day. You talking about the one that he said, uh, that he said something about um, she's acting like all the other women on the internet. <laughs> she acting fast or some shit like that. He says she acting all grown on the internet, just like the rest of you women. Oh, that one. Yeah. I don't know why what made Robert say that. Somebody said she is, she, she, she wants attention from her father. Oh, She said, call him so he can try to manipulate her so he can use her and her baby for content now that he then fall off. What? Somebody said he did respond. Yeah, I read his response. He said, don't listen. He said, when have you ever heard me say anything about you? He says, let me read it. Deshari, what have I said about you? You can't be listening to what other people are saying. I said, that's what he said. <laughs> then he gonna say, that ain't me. You know, I get my page hacked all the time. You know, Brianna hacked my page. That's what he gonna say. <laughs> He'll find a way to say, Brianna wrote that, not me. She said, y'all might as well just leave RH alone because that ninja is not a real father. He don't know shit about being... No, daddy, LOL, he wasn't raised. Woof a damn. <laughs> He's not a bad dad. He just need to stop commenting on her sexuality. Mm. Letting us see how he interacts with her. Okay, that bastard lied and deflected as usual. She is hurting inside. She watches her father and the things that he says. She's trying to prove a point that let people know who he really is. I think she's hurting to see her father have two daughters, but he's only loving one and she gets no love. Well, what did he say the other day? He said the other day that um, the younger one normally gets the most attention anyway, because the other one is grown. He said she is grown. And it's funny to me that he says she's grown, but the supporter says she's not. The supporter called the her a little girl while he call her grown and can take care of herself okay he said she don't need me she's grown she got this she's a good mama she can take care of herself wow robert trying to use her that's why he said call him he wasn't expecting that response from her mm. that child just need to realize that man don't give a damn about her love his ass from a distance that's exactly what's going to happen when momo is old enough to speak for her herself. Ooh. Thank you for the super chat. She said, Robert ain't shit. Mm. She said, that was more to that conversation for him to say, call me. Mm. He was an absent dad with Desharia till Bree came around. He was absent for seven to eight months for Amora. He doesn't care about those kids. Mm. I have a 17 year old at college, but I still know he ain't grown. I got his back a thousand percent. And you do, child. I, I watch you have his back, honey. Honey, he is blessed, baby. I mean, he is slandering her all on the internet. Why can't she? Mm. He was just going to record her and she knows it. Mm. She said, uh uh, you owe me an apology before I call you. She said, Amor, do she look pregnant to you? Um, I'm not going to say that. I'm just going to say, who knows if that was an old pregnancy picture? You know, I really don't want to get into that. Like, oh, does she look pregnant or oh, is she pregnant or whatever the case may be? 
Her stomach did look a little big, but it could have been an old photo. You know, a lot of people post photos. I did see that, but then I was like, okay, maybe she didn't lose all the pregnancy belly either. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't want to be like them over there that's trying to take a microscope and stick it up somebody's coochie and into their uterus and be like, is there a baby there? Hold on. Is it one or two? Is there a baby? Let me check. Is there a baby? Oh my God. Is it a foot? Are they going to miss a thumb? Oh my God. Are they going to have three eyes? I definitely don't want to be that type of person. I don't want to be so fixated on what's growing in another woman's stomach or whatnot. Now, if she comes out and say she's pregnant, then I'm going to say she's pregnant. But until she come out and say she's pregnant, I'm not going to worry about if she is or she's not. And no offense to you, love. I know that's not what you meant. But, you know, we don't want to be like them other folks, honey, because they some more desperate mofos. No, she's pregnant with one. No, two. I think 20 of them up in there. Did you see? It? They ain't going to have no friends. And John L ain't going to love them. And, you know, come on, y'all. You know what I mean? Come on, y'all. They be like, John L ain't going to be stunning them babies. John L ain't even going to love the baby. If he love it, he only going to love the boy and not the girl. No, he's going to love the girl. He going to say damn to the boy. And, like, they so bothered. Big, big bod, okay? Period. She says, I don't know how any woman or man could be with someone who doesn't take care or not active with their kids. Well, um, are you saying season? How is he with Robert? Well, because she wanted him to give up custody. She wanted him to get sign over his parental rights. You know what I mean? She don't give a damn. She don't care. Not one bit. Thank you to Mary. She said, thank God I don't have a father like him. Ooh, honey, some of us had worse fathers, though, Lord Jesus. Yeah. She said, why haven't Momo been back on the clock lately? Oh, well, she'll be back this Friday. Remember, she, um, she, uh, Brianna missed a weekend, and then last weekend was Brianna weekend. I think they're going to stick back by the schedule. So I get it. I guess he'll get her this Friday, okay? Because this Friday will be the first Friday of the month. You know? Hey, just coming on. Who are we talking about being pregnant, girl? We ain't talking about nobody, child. We just talking about how we ain't about to get obsessed if somebody is pregnant or not, child. We ain't about to be like that. Mm -mm. You got a bunch of older women over there. That's they probably great great grandmas. They worrying about what's growing up in Brianna's coochie. And in her uterus. And if it's one, two, or five, does it have five toes or six? Is it gonna be cross eyed or not? I mean, does it smell fishy or like roses? Like they so obsessed with what's going on up in another woman's body that it's just absolutely absurd. Now, what is this? Mm. That's some crazy work. Crazy work. Mm -mm -mm. She don't take care of her own damn kids. Who? <laughs> Who we talking about? Don't take care of their kids. Yes, unfortunately, my father is way worse. <laughs> See, that's what I'm talking about. She's going to end up having to cut ties with him and go no contact. If he's not willing to validate her feelings, he will continue to cause her pain. She will eventually stop talking to him. I believe that. I believe that. Is roundish, I mean childish, is roundish and from what her mother showed her. She really don't have a choice to think that's how you're supposed to do. I was a teen mom myself. I got birth control right afterwards. Yeah, I think unless you're breastfeeding, I think you're supposed to wait like six weeks or something like that. But honey, that baby way more than six weeks old. So this is how I feel about it. Um, she said, we talking about Robert, right? We know his views are trash. He would try anything to get his views back. He's trying to mend fences so he can use her and her baby for content. 
I feel her because giving out dollars, but don't even care about having a place to sleep. He could have given Sierra something for that room. I don't know about that now. Because I don't even know if she's with her mother. From what I'm being told, she's not. But I don't know 100%. But I'm being told that she is not even with her mama. Because her mama ain't shit either. Her mama ain't shit either. For real. I ain't giving her no passes. They over there diagnosing her gifts from her supporters. <laughs> what? diagnosing oh my god like saying what do you mean by diagnosing like it was it a good gift or bad gift what do you mean when you say <laughs> what do you mean when you say diagnosing the gift like it was it a good gift oh really they over there saying what was a good gift and what was a bad gift Yay, we got internet sister in the house. Internet sister in the house. Yes. They over there trying to do a diagnosis of the gift. She said, I'm sorry, but her baby don't look like her or dad. She look mixed. She said, saying she bought them herself. All oh, they... Wait a minute, they're trying to say that Brianna bought all the gifts herself. Lord Jesus, these people are delusional. It's actually some people over there still think she's not pregnant. Brianna knows the spread all across her face. Her face is way bigger than it used to be, and they are up here trying to determine whether or not she's pregnant or not. My thing is, why does it even matter if she is or is she not? Just with Jenny, they was over there trying to say Jenny had a fake pregnancy. Why do, why do, why do women care if another woman is pregnant or not? Like, why? Why do they care? I don't understand. Please help me. Why do they care whether or not the person is pregnant or not? I don't get it. 